the wood arrives at the factory in trunks that can be between 1.5 and 4.5 metres long. But this fresh cut wood carries a lot of moisture trapped inside. So, two craftsmen reach for the bandsaw. Spinning at 400 RPM, it chomps through the trunks, creating 45 centimetre long billets. These blocks will each eventually make up to 30 chess pieces. But not before they've been dried with six months of sunbathing on the factory roof. With nine months of dry weather a year, when temperatures can reach 40 degrees Celsius, it's as good as a slow-drying oven. And for the blocks whose holiday is over, their transformation can begin. But turning wood this size would take hours, so first chess craftsman Manoj Yardav trims them into small blocks. Each block can produce one figure, and chess pieces used in tournaments all have to be a standard size. The different pieces have distinct markings, but there's no fancy machine that can create such intricate patterns. So they are carved by hand. But nobody wants a wobbly knight or a precarious pawn in their set. So to ensure consistency, Rishi's company have their own special tools. These are the special tools which we design for all the chess pieces. If you look at the, all the cutters over here, we have the pawn, we have the knights, we have the queen. Every shape is a different, every design is a different. These metal tools are handmade by the factory with a unique profile corresponding to the shape of the chess piece they will make. Now, the wood can be secured onto a lathe, spinning at a dizzying 2,400 RPM. Ravinda Yadav holds the turning tool against the wood. Shifting the metal tool gouges out the distinct design of the king. It takes around five to seven minutes to create each piece, leaving behind a small mountain of shavings. But there's one piece that takes a lot longer, the knight. The highly detailed knight is the star of the show. But a spinning lathe and metal gouge isn't intricate enough to produce this majestic piece. Knights are really difficult to make. We can make hundreds of uh, pieces in a day. We can make maybe five or ten knights every day. So that's a totally handcrafted chess piece, and no machinery has been used. Rishi's skilled workers first cut out the rough shape of the knights. Then they use a metal burr spinning at 1,400 RPM to carve out the intricate design. Each piece can take them an entire day. The pieces are finished, but not at their fighting weight. Left like this, they get knocked over too easily. So, to keep them on their feet, a small weight is to be added. 30 grams for the pawns, 130 for the larger king. A special bit gouges a round hole in the base. And the weight is glued in place. Chess pieces need to move smoothly and quietly across the board, so felt is added to the bottom. A quick polish finishes the process, leaving a gleaming set ready for many battles ahead.